Hello there ladies and gentlemen, thrill seeks of all ages, my name is Coaster Chal and welcome to Coaster Chal YouTube channel. <laughs> Hello there ladies and gentlemen, thrill seeks of all ages, Coaster Chal here, Doncaster born, but built for theme parks and welcome to another theme park newsroom update. Today we're going to be speaking about Chessington World of Adventures. This news has been out for a good few days now, but I've only got the chance to make this video now. They've given the green light for Chessington to go ahead with Project Amazon, the brand new land and thrilling roller coaster for 2023. Now, before we get started, guys, make sure you do like the video if you loved it. Comment down below your thoughts and opinions. Subscribe if you're new around here. Click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. Also, guys, check the description down below for social media links and the Google Forms link where you behind the camera can submit your own video ideas. And for now, guys, let's speak about the go-ahead for Project Amazon at Chessington World of Adventures Resort. So Chessington World of Adventures has been given the green light. Construction can now go ahead with planning permission now finalised with the walls site uh, with the site walls up and work on clearing already underway. The project, set to include three new rides, including a brand new roller coaster attraction, is planned to open in 2023. The new roller coaster is well needed, and it's the first new coaster at the park since the 2004 Dragon's Fury. The ride is expected to be a wing coaster built by manufacturer Bulger and Mabillard, aka B and M. Featuring multiple launches and a boomerang layout, the ride is the first of its kind for the manufacturer. Alongside the new roller coaster, there will be two other attractions. One is a Miami type ride and the other is a small children's carousel attraction. The area will also feature heavy theming, including a large themed structure that lays within the layout of the new roller coaster. Other large theming statues and themed paving and planting complete the area. Thought to be themed after the Jumanji film series, the new area looks set to be a game changing addition theme park. Now let's speak about my thoughts on the go ahead on Project Amazon. There we are ladies and gentlemen, thrilled six of all ages, that is speaking about the go ahead for Project Amazon at Chessington World of Adventures Resort. Now we've covered this project from the first rumours and the first planning images uh, right from the very start of the project um, and for me this again like, like the information I just read out, this is a game changing addition for Chessington. I think it gives them a very nice solid few additions to the park um i mean first of all the two other attractions the miami type ride and the children's carousel vast array of audiences target audiences for the park and then you've got the big signature thrilling coaster uh that will be the signature ride at the park for me for me it overtake well it could potentially overtake vampire as the signature roller coaster in the theme park you've obviously got your other coasts like your rattlesnake your dragon's fury your scorpion express but for me, in terms of big thrill rides, this is the biggest thrill ride Chessington will, will make at the moment. And it could pave the way for future additions to come in the thrill market. And I think that it could be a nice, interesting addition to the park. And now we've got the go ahead. We can just count down the days till 2023 in the back of our minds and when this opens. Um, Obviously, the rumour at the minute in terms of theme is looking increasingly likely to be Jumanji uh, and using the IP. It's not, you know, an unknown uh, variety for Merlin to use intellectual properties or IPs. Uh, so the Jumanji IP was an IP that I was expecting at some point at Chessington, to be perfectly honest. Um, I've got a feeling this Jumanji IP is a two-year deal because obviously you've got Jumanji the Adventure opening this year which is a dark ride at, at Gardaland, a dark ride sort of coaster kind of thing uh, at Gardaland. Um, and then you've got this rumoured Jumanji area with a coaster at Chessington the following year. So I've got a feeling it's a two-attraction deal, a sort of two-for-one IP deal. Um, and I think that Merlin are definitely making the best business proposition out of this intellectual property. I think I've said before though, my worries in the past has been what kind of, um, what, what, what will they do when the intellectual property runs out? So that'll be a question asked later on down the years, but overall, solid edition for Chessington. But there we are guys, thank you very, very much for watching this video, make sure you do like, comment, subscribe, and for now, my name is Coach Chell, keep living the coast life, and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care guys. Have a Chessington-tastic day.